My name is Ayana. And my name is uh, Abigail. And my name is Elliot. And today we will be presenting our local technology, which is a necklace that it lights up and tracks your location, as demonstrated by Elliot. Um, it works by providing a light and provides you with a tracker to keep you safe. By using this, it will help keep many people safe because um, usually today, um, um, we can all admit that our environment is not the safest and we decided to invent something that will help keep many people safe which is a tracker right here that um, has a button and whenever you feel like you're in danger um, you just tap the button and it sends your location to three of your closest people or you can choose as much as close people as you want to get that get your location and if you're, if you're moving it, like, it still continues to track your location continuously and we and then it also sends your location to the cops and the cops know to, to go to where you are right now right away <clears throat> um we faced many challenges when designing this product um we faced not knowing what invention what invention to make and when we did come up with an invention we found out that it was already invented we overcame this by taking something that was already invented and maybe improving it to make it even more like safer and, and, and better um, doing this project helped helped us understand our uh, helped us expand our knowledge, uh, help us get a better understanding of what coding truly is and what it is actually like to code and truly make something new that the world has yet to see. Speaking of coding, I will now pass. Um, I will now pass the. What is it? The, I will now let um, Abigail talk about how she coded. Just. Hi. So what we did exactly for the coding was. Let's use the light as an example. So what we did, as you can see, the LED light keeps going on and off. So how we did this was using the LED coding that, that we have right here. And in order to program it, we put it to the light, but instead of it like blinking on and off by itself, we can just use the push button to go on and off whenever you want to. So this is how we can express how the light can go on and off. And now that being to Elliot. Thank you for coming to our presentation and we hope to see you soon and get our product. Hi, my name is Deseo. And today I will show you, I will show you about my project. Um, and, and their use. Um, the use of these glasses are that for people that can't see very well, there's a light um, right here at the very end that will help them see a bit better, but the cane is more ideal to, to the idea. And now passing the speaker um, to DeSeo. Hi, my name is DeSeo and um, for the cane, uh, I used for the servo on the slide and why it will help is because when you're walking, there's a button, open the button, all right? And then once you press that, it will detect where, if someone's coming towards you or if there's something on the ground, so then you would move out of the way. Now I'm passing it back to the Zion. Okay. Uh, thank you for listening to our project. I hope you have a good day. Hi, my name is Jasmine or Jazz. Um, I'm here to tell you about my invention and how it works. First, this is um to so for example, if people are in traffic, um, and so like if you can't hear, um, you just like pop these on and like it will like tell you when to like move so um like for example if you're like in traffic and someone is honking at you and you can't really like know why they're honking at you this will just tell you like when to move or like what to really do when someone's honking at you or like something important but you can't hear it's like a, it's like a short speech but like i wasn't here on like the next day, so I had to like invent something fast. Hi, uh, I'm Jaden and I am Hector. And so our project is an app called Recycler Snap. So basically, it's an app that like scans like products that, and it can determine if it's re recyclable or or not. And um, yeah. This can like help people because this is, can help reduce the problem of plastic and trash. This can also educate kids or adults to know like what's recyclable or not. And so our servo here, it kind of relates to our project since like whatever like um, color lights up, it could like also tell like 
like if it's recyclable or not. Um. So. Uh, so um. Yeah. So basically, how it works is it uses like your camera on your phone, and so you know how like on your like food they have like the little QR codes. That that's what it scans, and it can determine if it's uh, if you can recycle it or not. And yeah, that's our project. That's actually cool. yeah. that's Hello, my name is Jose. I created something called the light and breathe machine. Like glasses can tell if it's like hot and these fans can turn on. And this light is like when it's dark, it also can turn on. So it can also be useful for when it's hot or when it's dark. It can also be useful for like if you're in an amusement park and if it's like hot, the fans can turn on. And if like the lights can turn on, like if it can be like for night and for the music part she can be useful and, and these glasses can be useful for night and night and that's our project thank you hi my name is brian i'm here to talk to you about my adventure i 40 percent of the u.s population is obese so i decided to make a fitness uh tracker it is called the calculator uh, calorie calculator it, it scans the food that you like the uh, scans the calories on the food and it calculates how many like steps you need to walk or run and it's designed like a fanny pack my name is alexium my name is andres we made a pin that when you get home it cleans your entire house and if you want to it can also cook you food if you don't want to the pin detects when you get home, and it tries to identify who you are. So you can also register other people and let them in. That's the pin. Is this the ball? Thank you for listening. My name is Daniela, and I created the navigation sunglasses. So, so basically they help blind people navigate around their house or the street or wherever they're walking. So inside, so on the outside, it just looks like normal birthday glasses, but inside they have wires and LEDs. The LEDs have vi vibrations that can sense where you're walking and how safe is it. Um, it's also saying um, where like you're walking or where you can walk. And you can also connect it to your phone to get wherever you wanna go. For example, um, you can see that the red represents um, the left and then the clear represents the right, but also you can put them on and it can sense where there's danger, which re is represented by the red. And then the clear is pretty much self-explanatory. It just means that your area is clear. I designed this because I don't struggle with vision problems, but I know many people out there do. And I want, I want to make the world a better place um, to navigate in. Thank you for listening. Hi, I'm Daniel, and my invention is for people that don't don't really know how to get get to places without um, using a map. If my invention is called All Map, and it, it's it basically all there, any type of map you want want to use. See, if if you want to go somewhere, you can look for look for it on this, and it it goes on your wrist and but. And it, if it, if you lo lose something like your phone or anything, you can you can look for it on on this like like for if you if you like lost something, you can look for it. And like if you're lost or or don't know where to go, you can go on your 
want to all map and look look at where you are and look for the nearest place you can go.